In this video, I'm going to be talking about how to use the basic search function of SPSU Hive Search. In most cases, when you're using SPSU Hive Search, you'll just be using our tab search box where you can type in your search right here in the search box, and then of course, click the search button and you'll enter Hive Search. However, you can also go to the links down here and go to basic search and enter the Hive Search that way. You'll enter a page that looks like this. This basic search is exactly what it says. It's basic. You'll have your search box here at the top. It tells you which profile you're searching. SPSU Hive Search is the overall Hive Search. You've got your search box and you've got three ways of limiting your search. You can do keyword, title search, or author search. You also have your Hive cells down here. These let you go into specific subject profiles such as architecture, business, communication, science and technology. Search all databases takes you right back to SPSU Hive Search. There's also a link to the LV Johnson Library and to LibGuides. So let's say you want to go and search in the engineering profile. When you click on engineering, watch what it does up here at the top. Now you're searching engineering in SPSU Hive Search. So pay attention up here and you'll know which types of databases that you're searching. And then just click search all databases to go back to the main SPSU Hive Search. And there it is up there, SPSU Hive Search. To get more options, click on the Search Options button. And this will give you different search modes. You can do Boolean and phrase searching. You can apply related words or search within the full text of articles. This is where you can also use other limiters. Catalog only. That only searches the LV Johnson Library catalog. Um, it doesn't include any of the databases. Items from Gilfind at SPSU and Galileo searches both the catalog and the databases that are aggregated in Galileo. So it doesn't search any of the extra databases that come with Hive Search. Full text will search for sources that are full text, obviously. Scholarly peer reviewed journals will only pull up the journals that have been peer reviewed, so you won't get any books with that kind of a search. You can also search for a specific title or a specific journal title. You can search for a specific author. You can search specific date ranges. And if you're looking for diagrams or other types of images, you can limit to those. And of course, you can limit to a specific language if you wish. And that's really all there is about the basic search. And you've got your hive cells down here at the bottom, and that should get you started for doing a basic search.